Okay, it's Monday. We're ready to start week four of the vlog. And as I said last week, I was hoping in week four to ship all of the EVA utility pouches. These right here may not happen. Um, as I'm thinking about it, it might run into the weekend, but we'll see. And we'll just get as far as we can on these. This is gonna be another week of working and wrapping things up, but I'll try and do a better job of uh, explaining the process. Right now, I've got to sweep this place up because it's pretty filthy. Let's go. Okay, so this is genuinely one of my least favorite parts sewing around these edges, these pieces that then flip outward. But this is the inside obviously, so doing the stitch around here. But you just gotta be careful and go slow. So let's knock them out. I'm hoping to get all of these done today and on to the next step. Okay, we're back and it is Tuesday of week four. Finished up all of the uh, sewing operations I had to do yesterday. It took just about most of the day. And we are ready to start adding bias tape, which we have right here, all cut up, ready to go, ready to add to these. And if we get that done today, we can start adding the interior back panels and exterior. They're one and the same. We can add these and that'll be a big step. Hopefully we'll get there. We got a lot of time. So let's get to work. Okay, so we've got a little bit of a problem here. Actually kind of a big problem. So I was getting ready to start working on these and I noticed that my knee lifter for my sewing machine was a bit squeaky. So I thought I'd lubricate. Well, when I did that, I noticed that this bar, because it was too lubricated, the bar was just spinning. So there's actually a hole for that set screw to go in. Lined up the hole with the set screw, tightened it in, good to go. But then the knee lifter was in this position. It's supposed to be perpendicular to the ground. Well, in this position, it's no good. So I had to turn it. As soon as I went to loosen it, it sheared right off. Oops, here it is. However, this thing's never been super tight. So I thought, well, maybe if I just apply a little bit of pressure, it will straighten out and that'll be good. That's where I fucked up. I ended up bending this plate that pushes up that lever and if you can see, it's started to tear. It's like a flimsy little, looks like it's aluminum. So where we're at now is the knee lifter is out of position. I could probably use it uncomfortably, but if I were to continue using it, this plate is just gonna break. So it's gotta be fixed before we can move on. Good news is, I'm prepared. We're not dead in the water. I knew that that was a critical piece when I got the machine, so I bought spares. Ah, need a better step stool. If I 
notice that something is a critical item, try to keep a spare on hand at all times. This is the kit with the knee lifter pad, the plate that I need to replace. This one feels like it's steel, hopefully. And then the block with the non shorn, sheared, shorn bolt that goes there. So we're not dead in the water. It's not the end of the world. It's just gonna take some time to go ahead and replace the parts that need to be replaced. Then after that, we'll get to work. Let's go. just got to basically everything outside of that little dimple on this edge needs to be ground off some new bolts for this because these things are I can just feel it tightening them they're just about to shear right off so yeah let's go again we'll go run it back I don't want to take a risk putting this whatever that block this block back on tightening the set screw and having it shear just to test this out. Perfect. Uh, it looks like... Yes. Our grinding work worked. All we need now is to figure out the threading of the bolts for this block and go get some. We're only so far about an hour and a half behind schedule. All right, let's go to the hardware store. Okay, there's the bolt we need replacements of. We will take it over here. And I believe it was metric. Yep. Good guess. Hopefully they've got this. All right, to the hardware store.
tighten it really tight and not worry about shearing that. Looks like we're all set. Let's clean up and start the day. All right, it is Wednesday morning. Thursday morning, it's Friday.